over unders today possibly one of my most favorite bunch of intervals not because it's a magic workout just simply because you're just going really hard or going really easy very simple <laughs> can't mess it up really can't mess it up I just had to do the first set on the main road from Ammonford to Llandoilo and it's a flat sort of undulated road I dislike doing these over-unders on that type of road because more often than not I end up on like a rest period on one of the over like on one of the lumps and then I have to sprint down as I said so <laughs> but I'm heading to Carmel which is just to my left and uh, I'm gonna do the next set up a climb. The first set was uh, 30 15s, 13 reps, 10 minutes recovery. Now I'm going into 30 30s, uh, but I'm actually going to be pedaling during the rest period of this one. So the 30 second rest period I'll be in zone two um, rather than you know completely taking my foot off the gas. Hunchback head is back. That's my uh, that's my wind jacket. Uh, good place to put it if you uh, run out of pockets. Pro tip: I've run out of pockets because I've actually got a bit of a mission today. I'm heading over to the mechanic. That's what I call him, the mechanic uh, in Kamarden, Emir from a bike. And uh, we're going to fit a new bottom bracket today. So fun fact, uh, this road was absolutely awful. This is the Llandoilo to Camarthen Road. Or Camarthen to Llandoilo, whichever way you're riding. But this was awful up until the Women's Tour Britain visited and they decided to tar market and now it's like buttery smooth and very fast good work council come on then i'll tell you one thing you're not short of in wales and that's castles and castle like buildings Looks like something of a Marvel film. Edward, how are you? How are you, sir? I thought you said it was, I thought you said it was your day off today. Always have spare base layer or a spare jacket, which I've got two with me today to uh, make sure you don't get cold. It's like my biggest concern whenever I stop anywhere is getting cold. I'm old before my time. <laughs> so, from, it, from in the fun group in Marmot, you need a 53 rather than a 52. But Anyway, bikes. Bikes, Ica. Possibly. Well, it looks like it. <laughs> That's what was in the picture that was yeah. sp not oh, spoiled. Or stainless steel. Um, it's a certain price. Five or fifty each for the for the chrome ones. And stainless then. Uh, in fact, I'm going to this morning. Four hundred and fifty. Eight fifty. So I didn't realise it was a. Oh, um, well, what do you suggest then? Well, you go faster with stainless, don't you? And it's it's wind it's some men out, so you're not gonna get the crap. There we are. Um, we'll go with the not thing, not yeah. so crap. Have <laughs> <laughs> oh, I done a good job? I can give this a wipe with a rag while it's off. Oh, you'll do it. Does that come with the service? Yeah. <laughs> I've got oil on my hands now. There's going to be 
like a mixture of components, right. a number of brands. I think that's the advantage of being involved with like people like Chicken, yeah. is that they have brands that they know and have worked with. <coughs> yeah. And they've just said like, so-and-so once, once in, you know, another brand's like, yes, we want to give tires towards that. So like, right. yeah, they've just, they've pulled out the stuff and they've said we've even got like certain brands in reserve. So, you know, like AX Lightness, right. they're in reserve. What's that kit you're wearing? Oh, <laughs> stolen my kit again. Yep. Have you seen what they've done to the cycle path up here? Nope. They've tarmacked it. No way, it's got gravel in there. Yeah, it was all gravel before. Now they've tarmacked it. Perfect tarmac. And now they've ruined it. Everyone's raving about it, saying that it's like a really awesome piece of cycle path now because they've tarmacked it. And we're like, me and Anthony, you know, like we want gravel. It was like proper, like loose, like gravel as well, and mud. You used to get like good mud. Oh, it's just been ruined. It's no pleasing some people. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> right, to be fair, it is quite nice. That's like you have had a puncture in the winter. This is like the Arenberg Forest, doesn't it? Yeah. So I've been to see Emir. New bottom bracket installed. I've done a proper good job of the last uh, bottom bracket that was in there. To be fair, it's been in there since I had the bike. But uh, complete right off. So I was riding back, back towards the flat. Charlie's out for a spin. Oh my word. Oh, all right. God. Not doing a good job of advertising this part of uh, Wales. <laughs> We're on the uh, Venival cycle path. Well, we jumped on it at Tumble. We're going to turn off soon, and I know a little shortcut. And we're going to pop out uh, the top of Flanon and then uh, vomit all the way back down the magic carpet. Oh, we call it the magic carpet because the road is like this. Like this. That's, a, that's a dance move, eh? Well, yeah. It's not done like that. No, that's one of your dancers. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is it. This bit here? I think so. Unless they fenced it up. Oh no, they haven't. I think there's a gap. Right, technically, this isn't one of my shortcuts. One of my famous shortcuts. Squirrel! There he is. A tree. Can you see him? But uh, for some reason, there's a hole in the fence here, and it just brings you out on this lane, which is where I was climbing the other day. So you can jump off the cycle path and go up this lane. Right. Eh? Yeah. Huh? What is the quality of this lane? Um, quality of said lane is three out of ten. Right. Now the worst bit is back down the hill. Oh, thanks. No, the best bit is this bit. So there's a cycle path just down there under the bridge. We come round here and we go up the hill. Oh dear. <laughs> How long is the hill? Not long, a couple of minutes. Oh. Ten minutes. I just got in. Bike is now on turbo, ready for tomorrow. Swift race time. Uh, Got to keep the subscribers happy and all that. Uh, can't just train. Uh, <laughs> Got to do some racing and live streaming so that people are happy. Uh, no, just joking. Uh, right, so I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.